Okay, so now we know our way around live a little bit. We're getting there. We definitely know how to find things and where to get access to all of our tools. That's over here in the browser. So now let's talk about actually like getting some music into this thing. So I'm going to clear this out. In fact, I'm going to make a new session. So I'm going to go command N. I'm not going to save this. Okay. I'm going to close this up clear that search out, just do a clean slate. So earlier I talked about the kind of three ways that we can get content into live. And those three ways depend on whether or not we're working with a MIDI track or an audio track. So for a MIDI track, we can record a MIDI file. We can just create MIDI and we can import a MIDI clip, okay? We'll do all three of those in a minute. For an audio track, we, can, we have two options. We can record audio or we can import an audio clip. So that's what I wanna do in this section, is get clips into our content area here, specifically, focusing on the recording aspect of those of both audio and MIDI. So so I it's a little out of the scope of this class to go into everything about audio recording theory. We won't have time for that, but uh, I do want to show you how to connect a mic to Ableton and record. So and the same thing with MIDI connect a MIDI controller and record. So that's what we're going to do. Before we do any of that though, we need to take a trip to the preferences, our settings to make sure that we're set up to be able to record. So let's go there first. 